Tonight, protesters descended on Milwaukee Public Schools central office demanding change. They're calling for MPS to cut its ties with the Milwaukee Police Department and get police officers out of schools. Rebecca Clough is live with what that group wants tonight. Yeah, guys, what you're hearing behind me, of course, you're seeing smoke in the air. That is from the protesters themselves. They're also shooting off fireworks. Somebody walked by with um, some smoke just to kind of show in the air. If you want to turn that way, you can see the protesters here on 68th and Wells, right outside Collectivo. They have been marching all day. People are calling on Milwaukee Public Schools to end its contract with the Milwaukee Police Department. People rally outside of Milwaukee Public Schools headquarters, listening to speakers talking about why the district should end its contract with Milwaukee police. According to the Black Educators Caucus, MPS spends nearly $500,000 a year on a contract with Milwaukee police. They say that money goes to having six specially trained officers available to respond to school incidents. The Black Educators Caucus and some protesters want that money to go to supporting students in other ways. When we talk about uh, uh, redirecting those funds, we want those funds more directed to social workers and counselors and putting more into restorative justice practices and conflict resolution and peer mediation practices. Some MPS parents and students were also out protesting, concerned about how quickly school leaders are willing to call the police, especially on minority students. We have senior pranks. I don't feel like the like the police should have been called for our senior prank. Bringing um, eggs and what um, toilet tissue to school, there shouldn't be police being outside of our school giving us tickets for doing our senior prank. In 2018, federal officials found Milwaukee schools had discriminated against black students, saying black students were receiving harsher disciplines than their white peers. Two years ago, MPS reached an agreement with the Education Department's Office of Civil Rights to work to change its practices. But protesters say little has changed. I have a sister and her children, you know, they've had issues with the, uh, the cops coming to the school. As opposed to just, you know, talking to a child and kind of, you know, working with them, they automatically write up the students and send them out right away. And again, this protest is heading east on Wells. Uh, if you've been hearing some fireworks here in the Tosa area um, or loud bangs, those are fireworks that are going off over and over and one right above us right now. Um, the protest continues to head east. They plan to be meeting again to talk about this tomorrow in a special board meeting at Milwaukee Public Schools headquarters. Reporting live, Rebecca Clough, TMJ4 News.